Hey everybody, I'm Tom, uh, here with Electric Imp, and I just wanted to share uh, my hackathon project from the first Electric Imp company hackathon last month. I built a traffic light, as you can see here. Um, it's a little, uh, little tiny piece of tech. We've just got an Imp, an Imp breakout board, a couple of pieces of foil that we've set up as a capacitive touch sensor, which is kind of fun, and uh, a bunch of LEDs under a domed piece of plastic. Um, so as far as the imp's concerned, all it is is a light fixture. And we've got a couple of FETs here on a surfboard so we can switch some current around for the LEDs. Not a whole lot in the box. And uh, what's neat about this uh, is two things. One is that uh, we've set up the Electric Imp agent to serve a tiny web page so that the user can interact through the browser to change some settings with the traffic light. And the other is that uh, we actually have the agent querying an API uh, in the open internet to get some data and do something on the device with it. And in this case, what the agent's doing is it's looking at Google Maps at the traffic data to figure out whether my commute in the morning or the evening is going to be good, medium, or wretched. And it'll let me know by lighting the light up green, yellow, or red. Um, so if you want to take a look over here, I'll show you kind of how we go through changing the route. Here's the web page that we're serving out of the agent. It doesn't look like much. Uh, it's just a little web form. But if I put in a root string, say Hayward, California to Oakland, California, which I happen to know for a fact right now is experiencing some heavy traffic. And we'll send the agent off to check that out. Now you notice this takes a second. Uh, we're doing this synchronously. And since the Google API doesn't actually hand us the traffic data unless we buy a $10,000 license, um, what we're actually doing is we're using some web driver code to actually open a browser, get the web page, and then scrape the data we need out of it, pack it up into a little block of JSON, and send it back to the agent. And as we can see, it accepted the data, and now the agent knows that the commute between Hayward and Oakland is bad, and it's letting me know that now is not a good time to go drive that route. So that's my imp project. I was pretty happy that it worked out. There were some really cool new ideas going on here, and uh, I'm really looking forward to the next Electric Impactathon. Hopefully I'll have something to share with you then.